What's up everybody, this is Harry, and today it's hammer time. I have these two slabs that I made here. One has the salt fiber chop in it, the other has helix micro rebar in it. So I'm gonna do a simple drop the sludge hammer on it and see um, what it takes to break them. Now the basalt's not looking too good so far. I was just moving this piece around a little and I cracked off the tip so I'm not expecting that one to do very good. So for this test what I'll do is just let the hammer go. This is an eight pound sludge hammer. I'm just gonna drop it from here and see what it does. Up here, I'm just going to drop it down and see if it breaks. Okay, it did crack. Actually, it may have cracked earlier. There's a crack going through here, but the basalt fiber chop is holding the cement in place. But there is cracking all through this little slab here that I made. So you see that broke off with a little bit of, of a twist. Actually, it didn't take much at all to do that. So next, I'm going to do the uh, slab reinforced with helix. Okay, that cracked. I tell you, that took a lot more force to break than the basalt fiber chop. Now, there was no set recommended amount of helix micro rebar to put in here so this is no scientific test this is just me messing around trying to see for myself what the difference would be between the two reinforcers the basalt fiber chop and the helix micro rebar and I could tell you the helix micro rebar was a lot stronger and a lot harder to break apart than the basalt fiber chop. This that broke this comes apart very easily without much force. I just went you know along the crack. These pieces here see there's a crack straight through it and I can't I can't break this one apart. So it's a huge difference. And it's real pointy, so you gotta be careful. Anyway, that seems a whole lot stronger. Uh, so anyway, again, this is just me messing around. This is not no real scientific test. Um, with the proper dosha, doses of the rebar, you can really make this stuff super powerful. Anyway, that's it for now. Peace.